Hello everyone, hope you guys are doing absolutely fine. So here I have this smart MCB and in this video I'm going to show you how to use this smart MCB with the smart and application and how to make the connections. So here as you can see I have two different sections. One is input and another one is output. Here we need to provide the input supply and here we need to connect the device. So on the input side there are two terminals this one is the neutral and this one is the phase we need to provide neutral to this point and we need to provide phase to this point here i am using this extension board to provide the power supply to this mcb and as you can see this one is the neutral point and this one this is the phase so we need to connect this point to the neutral and this one to the phase the moment you connect this green light will turn on and on the output side you need to connect your device so I have connected a test board with one point here and another one here now I can control this device from the smartphone so now let us move on to the next steps where I will show you how to configure this device with our application now to pair the smart MCB with the smart and application, you first need to open the smart and application. Then you need to click on the settings, go to devices, click on this add icon. In the list you will see this MCBs column and here you will need to click on smart MCB. Click on next and here in this process we need to scan the QR code which is present on this and on the user manual. Now you need to click on next. Here you need to open your Wi-Fi settings. You will see this network by the name of smart underscore MCB underscore your device ID. You need to connect to this Wi-Fi network and then you need to go back to the application. Click on this checkbox, click on next. Now this device will scan your Wi-Fi network and here you need to select the Wi-Fi network, enter the password and it will take 5 to 10 seconds to get the configurations done and after that you can add your smart MCB to the smart M application. After the configuration is done you need to click on next. Here you need to assign the room. I am assigning the test room. Here you need to do, define the name for your device and writing it MCB. Then you need to click on your device. Now the device is added successfully. To check the device, you need to click on these devices. Then you need to click on the room, and here you will see the MCB. It's currently off, and when I press on it, the MCB will turn on. 